Larry, did you kill Sharon? Larry Atkinson, now 64 years old, kept his eyes closed and was shaking at points as he was taken by EMS from the 50th precinct. He told officers he wasn't feeling well after his arrest for the strangulation deaths of a mother and daughter in their Harlem apartment in 1994. PIX11 News covered the double murder on February 20th, 1994, nearly 29 years ago. 57-year-old Sarah Roberts and her daughter, 25-year-old Sharon Roberts, were found dead in their apartment on the sixth floor of the Grant Houses on West 125th Street, both strangled in their bedrooms. Anybody could be in the hallway. I think it's a shame. It's kind of scary, that's all I can tell you. Detectives at the time told us the bodies were discovered by the home health care worker assigned to take care of Sharon, who was intellectually disabled. She came over and found that the door was unlocked. The home health care worker was not considered a suspect at the time and was cleared. Now, decades later, cold case detectives once again ran the DNA found at the crime scene through national databases, and they say it's a match to Atkinson. Larry Atkinson, now 64 years old, had been living here at 71 West 112th Street. This is where he was arrested. Neighbors saying they saw a lot of police activity. Sources say back in 1994, Atkinson had been dating the home health care worker who found the bodies. Monday night, Atkinson's neighbors didn't want to talk about the arrest on camera. And at the victim's apartment, almost 29 years later, tenants were unaware of the double murder. I'm trying to find somebody that would know somebody that lived here 30 years ago. Did you know Sarah or Sharon Roberts? And Atkinson has 13 prior arrests, according to police, and according to state records, five prior convictions in which he served under different aliases. He will now be arraigned on those two counts of murder as soon as medically possible.